In the upcoming months, New Jersey farmers and farm workers will start seeing a change in rules when it comes to work protection standards. Arnina Barati spoke to representatives from the Environmental Protection Agency to hear how these new requirements will affect New Jersey farm workers. Pesticides can be very toxic. You can have short-term adverse health impacts like dizziness, respiratory illness, uh, skin rashes, or uh, long-term health problems, including cancer and neurological damage. To help farm workers become less exposed to dangerous pesticides, the Environmental Protection Agency has updated their standards for the first time in 24 years. There be a minimum age before farm workers can apply pesticides. I was surprised that that didn't exist before here in the state of New Jersey. Farm workers will be trained before they enter farm fields that are treated with pesticides. Previously, they just needed to be trained within five days. Now it's before they go into the fields. Those are just a few of the new rules that will help the 13,000 farm workers in New Jersey stay safe and healthy. But to be able to be more protective of the people who were doing the work is also more protective for the environment. Some of the updates require easier access to water, new signage requirements for toxic air areas and training. Although there are farms who already follow similar rules, if violations of the new regulations are found, there will be fines and penalties. Eng says there's also a new provision in the regulation that protects workers from retaliation. We are, however, used to already implementing these regulations. We're up to date. Every day I update all the spray records. I make sure people know where they can go, where they can't go um, to keep our employees safe. The requirements are pretty straightforward. They're strict, absolutely. But if we can prevent exposure to pesticides, it's all worth it. Until the standards are fully effective on January 2nd, the New Jersey Department of Environmental Protection will be educating and informing farm workers of the upcoming changes. We'll help everyone comply, make people safe, keep uh, the farmers themselves protected, and also protect the environment. If we can make sure that one farm worker doesn't have a toxic exposure to pesticides, this is all worth it. I'm Nina Barati for SNJ Today.